Hi, this is Jo Strang of Blossom Holistics, just here with a tap along tapping video for anybody who is facing exams in the next few weeks. So I'm going to do this nice and slowly so that you can tap along to it and make sure I leave gaps so that you can just copy and tap at the same time. If the words don't exactly resonate with you, then that's okay. If you get a sense of what the feeling or what the sensation would be that would more aptly work for you, then you can put that in in place instead. And I'm going to try and keep this short so that it feels like you could take five minutes out of your revision plan or the night before or feel like you could just get this done to help you. Um, Tapping is going to reduce the feeling of fight or flight and hopefully help you to feel a bit calmer and a bit more able to focus. So here we go. Even though I'm feeling stressed, anxious, overwhelmed about these exams, I love and accept myself. Even though I'm feeling stressed about these exams, I love and accept myself. Even though I'm feeling really overwhelmed, I love and accept myself. Feeling overwhelmed about these exams. Not sure where the time's gone. I feel like I've run out of time to prepare myself. And I don't like that feeling. It makes me feel stressed. It makes me feel anxious. It makes me feel scared about going into that exam. What if I forget everything I've learnt? What if my mind goes blank? Feeling stressed. Feeling anxious. Feeling overwhelmed. I just don't want to face those exams. And I know they're coming up really soon now. Let's take a deep breath. I feel really scared. I'm scared I might fail. I'm scared I'm going to let other people down. I'm scared I'm going to let myself down. I don't want to fail these exams. I really want to do well. They feel so important to how I feel about myself and what I'm going to do next in life. I really want to do well. And I'm worrying that maybe I won't do so well. I feel stressed, overwhelmed by all that information. Wondering what I'm going to do next because there's so much of it. Finding it hard to focus. Sometimes finding it hard to sleep. Feeling irritable. Sometimes I've just had enough of that feeling, that feeling that exams is coming up. But I have been working hard. I've put a lot of time in. I've read things. I've written things out. I've listened to people. And I really have been trying, trying to, pre my, to prepare myself for the exams that are coming up. I've done other exams. I've done exams where I've done well. I've been pleased with the results. So I know I can cope with the process. I've done okay. When I haven't done okay, that's been okay too because I've learned something. So actually, this is a win-win. What if I go into this exam and see it as a challenge? If I do well, I 
looks fantastic. I really hope to do well in this exam and feel fantastic. If I don't do so well, guess what? I'm going to learn something. Because we learn things from failing things. We find out what we don't know so well. We find out what works for us. We find out that we can still cope, even if we don't do quite as we expected, even if life doesn't turn out quite as we expected. We can still cope and we can still do well. So either way, it's a win-win. And our exam results do not define us. It's great if we do well. It's great if they help us to move on and take the next steps in our life. But we're more than our exam grades. We're people with lots of other qualities, experiences, values, and we're worth lots of things, not just what our exam results tell us. This is important. I'm glad I've focused like I have. I'm pleased with myself that I've put the time in, and I'm feeling quite determined now. I'm going to give this exam my best shot. I've got a bit more time, I'm going to use it as best I can, and I'm going to go in with determination to try my best at this. And I'm going to try and look forward to the experience because I've prepared, I know lots of information and I'm going to approach this calmly and determinedly and make the best of the situation in undertaking these exams. So put your hand over your heart, take a nice deep breath. So anyone who has got the exams coming up, I really wish you all the best. I know it's not easy, um, but give it your best shot. All the best.